American architect John Portman once said, buildings should serve people, not the other way around. Some buildings in Jackson have seen better days. It was originally the, the original Sam's Warehouse in the city of Jackson. Uh, but as we acquired it this past year, we decided, you know what, let's turn to something that'll be good for the city. For years, it stood empty and unoccupied on Raymond Road. Now, it's been transformed into the Ark. We want this complex to be something that the family could enjoy, from basketball uh, to boxing to climbing wall to all of those things, even some for little kids later on. The Ark is already the home of the Development Academy Hoops program. All three of the Ark's full-scale basketball courts were filled over the weekend with Jackson youth playing the game they love, being in a team environment. We were just blessed to have the Ark. We were just thankful for Charles and his and Denzel and the whole TDA community. These four young men are products of Jackson. They grew up playing ball in the city. Oh, man, yeah. They come up different. Everybody very... sleep on Jackson. Now they're college athletes, hooping at area community colleges. They come to the Ark to mentor to younger kids to keep them off the streets and out of trouble and open their eyes to the possibilities. Jamar, Isaiah, Jordan, we all have, of course, one common thing. We all love the game of basketball. So we just we just come here, we fellowship together, we, we play ball together, we eat together. It's just, it's all love here. We all a family, for real. Crudup said the arc is for all of Jackson. We know South Jackson has some uh, some needs, especially when it comes to our youth and our kids. Uh, kids just don't have a whole lot to do, and so we want to give an adequate, fun, safe place. And the arc looks to be a building that serves people, not the other way around, especially for kids, even if basketball isn't their thing. You don't have to come to the art just for basketball. If you're trying to get in shape, you can just come to the art. If you need someone to talk to, you can come to the art. Um, we got trampolines, got pools, tables, everything here at the art. And there's just more to come. Just stay tuned. That was 16 WAPT Troy Johnson reporting. Uh, the ARC isn't fully open to the public yet, but tomorrow, Wednesday and Thursday, they will be open from 11.30 a.m. to 4 p.m. for kids of all ages, 13 and up, to play basketball during spring break. Cost $5. There will be security there and snacks for the kids, too. We have the location of the ARC listed right there on the bottom of your screen.